Welcome to the first episode of 413 TV, where we are going to talk about all different types of social media, social media platforms, new things that come out, uh, just anything social media in itself. For those of you that don't know what 413 Marketing Group is, we are actually a four, or, or I'm sorry, we're actually a social media marketing company that does consultations, training, social media management, and marketing for companies along with videos and video productions. So we do a couple different things here with TV and this is going to be the first time that we do an actual episode of 413 TV uh, regarding social media. So we'll uh, jump right into the show. Today we're going to talk about a new platform that is out that just came out about uh, I think about a month, month and a half ago and it's called Beam. I don't know if you guys have seen this yet or not, but it's a pretty awesome new platform that's out. It's created by a guy by the name of Casey Neistat. You probably have seen him. His YouTube channel is actually really, really awesome. We'll have that link there below here for you as well. But go check out Casey's uh, videos on YouTube and stuff. He does a daily vlog, he does live trips, he does all kinds of different things. So. Go check him out on YouTube first uh, and check his stuff out. Uh, he just Monday uh, surpassed the 1 million mark on subscribers too, which is awesome. So Casey, if you ever see this, if you ever grace us with your presence, awesome job, man. Congratulations on hitting 1 million viewers. Um, you are a definite inspiration in what we're doing and, and everything else of a lot of, lot of people that are doing it. So congratulations on the 1 million view. Back to Beam. Beam is created by Casey. Uh, he has a whole different, uh, what can I say, mindset of how social media could be done. What I like about Beam is this. It is so interactive. It takes away the guesswork of doing shooting. And what I mean by that is this. Beam, first off, how you find it is B-E-M-E. -E. It's right here. B-E-M-E. -E. Go check it out. It's only available right now for iPhones, so you can only find it on iTunes, but they are, according to Casey and his vlogs, they're going to be releasing it for Android very soon. They're working diligently on that. There's just some, I guess, legwork that has to be done to make that happen, and that's what they're doing. But back to how Beam works. The platform itself is really, really easy. First off, there's no pictures, there's no frills, there's no nothing to it. It's just usernames. But what the beauty of it is, is the fact that in order to take a beam, you don't have to stare at your phone and look through your phone and, and miss out on the sunset or miss out on the moment that you're trying to capture. You actually just simply take it and it works off of the uh, sensor on the front of the iPhone. And what you actually do is you just take it and you put it up to your chest and it starts recording. Or you hold your thumb over this sensor. If you want to take like a an actual selfie, you do it kind of old school and you turn the, the uh, the forward camera or the back camera towards you and cover up the sensor. It does not work off of the front camera. It only works off of the back camera. And the purpose of that is so you actually don't miss the, what am I trying to say? What's going on in front of you? You're not experiencing the moment through a screen. You're experiencing it through your own eyes, but you're still capturing it this way. So the idea behind Beam is phenomenal. I love it. Casey says that it removes the need for the creation and it makes it all about the sharing. You're not thinking about how do I make this really cool selfie look. I'm not thinking about how to make that really cool shot look. I'm not trying to make my eyes bluer when they're brown. I'm not trying to make myself look tanner by a filter. All those things, you're actually just capturing the moment and sharing the moment that you're actually doing or experiencing so that you can enjoy the moment at the same time. And he says, you know, it's where people can basically share your own self-expressions. And that's exactly what Beam was created for, is just to share your own self-expressions. And basically, it records four-second videos. And you can do a video montage of it if you want, so record as many as you want. In order to see it, how it works is you actually just hold your finger on one of the people that you're following. And it shows you the entirety of the videos that they captured. The cool part about it is, is once the once you viewed it, it's gone. You cannot replay it. It's gone, you can't go back and see it, you can't uh, save it, you can't do anything. So like Snapchat, if someone takes a picture and sends you or a video or sends you, you can, you know, you can screenshot that and save it. Beam, you can't do it. So it's complete privacy, which is awesome. So you don't have to worry about somebody taking 
you know, your picture and like modifying it and like sticking it out on the internet and making it all weird. The other cool thing about Beam is that it is community oriented. So you allow the people that you want into your community. You just don't go onto Beam and sign up for it. You actually have to know somebody that has a Beam account and you have to get what they call a Beam code. So like right here, this Beam code. You have to have a Beam code from somebody like myself and you say, hey, I want to be on Beam. I send you a Beam code, you put it in, all of a sudden you're on Beam and you're in like my network so I can follow you and you can follow me but no one else can follow and that's the cool thing about it. So it's a really private network that allows you to share your life through expressions of what you're viewing and they're also really very strict on like watching how things go too which is cool. So much so that Beam headquarters in New York, they actually have a flat screen TV up when you walk into the Beam office that shows three live beams happening at the same time. So when that beams over, it brings up another beam. So they actually are watching people express their sh and share their, their stories through Beam, which is really cool as well. And you can go on video and on Casey's video on YouTube and check that out as well. The only downfall about Beam right now is, like I said, it is only available on iPhone, but they are working diligently on Android to be able to do that. So be looking for that Android users uh, soon. Uh, it will be coming out here very shortly. I don't really know what else there is to say about it. Mitch, you, have you tried Beam out yet? I can't say I have a flip phone. Mitch has a flip phone. So Okay, so we're going to do a contest here. Mitch needs an iPhone. I don't know, maybe he doesn't like an iPhone, but we're gonna get him an iPhone in order so he can use Beam. And you can beam him up all day long and talk to him. Mitch is the cameraman here, brains behind the operation. He's just coming to work with us here. Excited to be working with him. Uh, you're gonna see him going throughout this stuff. So the cre creations that happen here is gonna be his mindset. So if something doesn't work, it's his fault, not mine. Totally joke. But if you are on Beam, go to iTunes, download it. It's B-E-M-E. -E. It's a little green and black app logo big b when you do it comment below this video whether you're watching this on facebook comment if you're watching this on youtube comment and say i want a beam code and i will send you a beam code so that you can get onto beam and start using it go check it out it's a really cool platform people are putting some really cool stories brand new social network it's only been out for like a month or month and a half but it's really really ingenious i love it i've been using it and testing it out and the other cool thing is is that when you actually look at Beam, if you're viewing someone's video, like I don't know anybody, I've never met, the only person I know on here is Casey. Uh, he posts like every day on it. But like this dude, Matt here, so if I put my finger on it, I'm gonna start playing Matt's video. If I like it, see this little reaction? If I just take that, it's actually taking pictures and you're sending your reaction through pictures. So you're, you're seeing who's actually watching your video and then you're actually interacting with them showing, hey, I like it. So you can give a thumbs up, thumbs down, smiley face, frowny face. You can do whatever you want to show them that you actually like that beam that they put out. The reactions are really cool. And then when you have reactions, it'll tell up you on the top that you have a reaction. I don't have any because I just put some out here, but you'll get a reaction and you'll see people's pictures. So you can be creative with how you react to it. Casey says he likes to be able to take like like still uh, stop motion so he'll turn his head. So whenever they flip through it really quick, it looks like his head's turning back and forth. You can do that, be creative with it. Some people are like sticking it like in their belt so that they can actually use their hands to show their story. Go check out Beam, see how it works for you. Comment below if you want a Beam code. I will give you a Beam code for free, no additional charge. So you can get on it and then I want you to try it out and then I want you to comment below this video and tell me what you think about Beam. Go check it out, B-E-M-E. -E. It is awesome, you're gonna love it. That's what we got for this first episode of 413 TV. Don't forget to follow us on social media. If you're watching us on Facebook, you're already there. But if you're not, Facebook is 413MG. Go check us out on YouTube at 413 Marketing Group. You can also follow us on Instagram at 413 Marketing, Twitter, 413 Marketing, Snapchat, 413MG. And you have to actually spell out the word 4 and 13, not the numbers. Snapchat's weird like that. Go check out what we're doing. And then also you can follow us live like people are right now on Periscope. Uh, just follow us on our 413 marketing accounts through Twitter and you'll be able to do that. Go check us out. Tell your friends, tell your family. Don't forget to go share us. Check out the website, 413 Marketing Group. All this has already been presented to you here. We will see you next time on 413 TV. Thanks for watching, guys.
Let's go.